came down a little bit beforehand but I wanted to check and see how far this is away from draining out again it's not far that water's only been running in about 10 minutes and it'll be running out in about 5 minutes so I'm going to I'm going to move this uh, cage here I brought I finally found my foreigner bolo that's what everyone calls it here it's my uh, this is a Harbor Freight machete and I'm, it's been missing about a year and Tata said he just found it he just found it down there by the by the new well I'm down here love As you can see, it's been well used. It's fixing to get used again. Get everything out of my pockets here. Do some serious waiting. I never did even put my wallet in my back pocket today. There it is. It was finally draining. Yeah. Look what I found. Actually, Tata found it. Down there by the old well. There's a new well. So, someone must have left that there. Yeah. I thought, I think it, this one moved, right? No. This one moved. Move? Or you? Well, I've already cut the line, so, no, it hasn't really moved. Where's your wallet today? Uh, I never even put it in my pocket today. Okay. <laughs> well, the water down at the bottom of this pond is actually cold. Really? Yeah. Because it's deep, look at all. Where are you going to put it? The day um, you will mob here? Yeah. Okay.
can come around to this side, love. Bring my thing. My mangosteen is growing. This is mangosteen, guys. See? Growing now. But the rambutan here, I don't know. People here don't know how what is a rambutan plant, maybe. Because they cut. I planted one here and they cut it. Where? I will go there? They cut it. This is the lansunis. And here is the other one. The lansunis one is taller than me now. Wow. Then, what I'm going to do? Oh, be. Where I'm going? You're going to tie this here? Yeah. Okay. Okay, go. I don't pull it too close. I'm test. Uh, I'm checking it with my feet. Okay. And there's a shade here, so... What I'm doing is checking to see how much space is between the bottom of the cage and the, and the pond. Because I want the... As these fish grow, they're going to start to breed. And I want there to be plenty of room. I want the eggs to fall through from the females mm. and the males not be able to fertilize them. So they're, I'm thinking about this much space, that's how much I'm doing between the bottom of the cage. Daddy, you're going to tie this? Tie this one there. To this tree. How about there? Uh, I would rather have it around that tree. So go ahead and shut it off, love, and, and tie that. An experiment. So I'm going to take some of this Kang Kong and just chop it up and throw it in there. Chop, chop a little. Just, just chop, chop. It will, it'll grow. Chop, chop, chop it like, mm -hmm. what, like this. Yeah, that, that thing is the roots. Oh. It will grow if it, it will not eat all. Shade the water a little bit. Uh, get more of it in this pond because it's only at the bank. The fish that were in here before <laughs> ate it all. Yeah. Uh, ate it back to the bank, and there was there was nothing for anybody. So, you know, I don't, I don't, I think as these fish get bigger, they're going to eat it faster than it's growing. It is bigger now. Uh, they're they're fingerlings now. They're bigger. They're growing. Mm. But I, you know, and I would think, you know, at least. I would think this would grow faster than they could eat it for another month or two, mm. and then you know it would have it would it would be bigger inside, and then they would have that much more to eat. Mm. 
before they ate it back down to nothing again because I'm sure that eventually they will have this eaten down to nothing. Mm. And one thing that I've noticed about this Kang Kong, when I, I noticed it when I, when we had it in the, uh, in the, where? In the, Oh, come on, brain. In the Azola pits that we were using for, uh, that had tilapia in them, mm -mm. the pits that had this Kang Kong in it, the water was much clearer. It didn't, it didn't, it didn't matter if there were a lot of fish or a few fish. Mm. You know, the water was much clearer. I think these roots uh, help to filter the water. Mm. Kang Kong is yummy also. Marcel loves it. I've had it. It's not, you know, it's kind of like turnip greens. It's edible. Turnip yeah. greens, mustard greens, that kind of thing. Yeah. I love it adobo. And yeah, it's reasonably I just high love protein it adobo. for these fish. Uh, it's a food adobo source. King Kong. The day. Adobo oh. King Kong. <laughs> you have a King Kong? What? King Kong. We call that Kang Kong. Kong, you, Kang Kong. Kang Kong? Well, that's yeah. what I say, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I said Adobong Kang Kong. I thought you were teasing me about my pronunciation again. <laughs> you know, everyone goes on and on and on about me teasing Marcel <laughs> for her pronunciation and her lack of knowledge about which direction north is. <laughs> she, she teases me constantly. <laughs> Every time I sp try to speak Visayan or a Visayan word, <laughs> she teases me. See? 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 That's life. Uh-huh. Yeah, give and take. Uh -huh. <laughs> what is that? So why don't you, uh, while, while we're continuing this give and take here, love, mm. why don't you go get a bucket of fish food and bring it down to me so I can feed it? No, I can't carry I can't. So he be... I thought when you come here, you already bring a bag. It's only like five kilos. Mm. See this man, really, he make me, uh, he make me a. Uh, what do you call that, daddy? <laughs> a helper? No, it's not a helper. A slave. Oh, so shall. A slave. No, if I if I made you a slave, I wouldn't I wouldn't be paying you. It's the same. Slave without payments. Oh, you get paid. Helper. <laughs> what is that? Is it that? <laughs> you're you, so, you get paid. You're so fucked. <laughs> <laughs> what, what kind of feed? The, the big one? Yeah. Okay. So we're done. Ah, he is done. These are much closer. I could even feed them the fry mash here. And mm -hmm. these guys are big enough now to where they're eating this starter. Mm -hmm. so I'm a happy camper. Actually, I, I'm going to come down tomorrow evening uh, and I'm going to chop, I'm going to spend like 30 minutes chopping up that Kang Kong. And I'm gonna fill that there up with it mm. because they were they were eating it when I came over here. They were already nibbling on it, mm. so they like it. They're bigger now, do they? They are big enough. Mm. They're growing. We're gonna harvest these little guys in four months. Yeah. Hopefully, we can get. I don't know. Four months. They should be at like uh, two to three per kilo. I think. Yeah. So you put. Maybe 1,800 of them in. I don't know how many we lost. I didn't count them. But maybe yeah. there's 1,800 in there. Uh, maybe 600 kilos harvest. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. It's on the uh, maybe. Okay. Alrighty. Thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Have a good day. Bye-bye.